today we will see sclerosis and mucosus in a how to draw them first of all let me draw the sclerosis in a If the cells are pyramidal in shape and look at the lumen, lumen is very small and it takes different stain. In the apical region it takes eosinophilic stain. So here you can mark or shade with eosin pencil, eosin on the apex. This is because it has got cymogen granules. That is why it takes this stain. Look at the shape of the cell. They are pyramidal shaped cells or triangular cells. Now the nucleus is round, but it is towards the base. So the nucleus is somewhere here, round nucleus towards the base. And the basal region you have to shade with the hematoxylin pencil. Because on the basal level of each cell there are a lot of rough endoplasmic reticulum that is why it is taking this hematoxylin uh, stain so it like it looks something like this it has got two different stains okay, basal basophilia and apical eosinophilia so this is regarding uh, serous acne now Let's draw mucus as a. So I'm going to represent here mucus as a also with this mucus as a. There are some peculiarities. So let's start drawing it. The cells are columnar type. Now let's draw one mucus acinae. So this is serous one, serous acinae. Let's draw nearby. Here the cells are tall. Columnar cells. And look at the lumen. Lumen is larger. Now it looks empty. Cytoplasm looks empty. Because the mucus which is produced by it would be washed away during histological preparation. But in some books it is written as it looks as if of a soap bubble soap bubble appearance the cytoplasm anyway coming to the nucleus the nucleus is placed at the bottom and it is flat nucleus 
flat nucleus. So this is the difference between a serous acini and a mucous acini. This you can find in different glands. Like in parotid gland, you will see more of serous acini. Whereas in mucous gland, like sub sublingual glands, you will see a lot of uh, mucous acini. There are a lot of things to say about this glands or this acini that we will discuss while we see the salivary glands. Thank you. Thank you.